Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Septet Gates LLC YouTube channel. I'm your host, and in today's video, we're going to delve deep into the world of life insurance. If you've ever wondered about the importance of life insurance, the various types available, and how to choose the right one for you and your loved ones, you're in the right place. So, let's not waste any more time and get started. Life insurance is a contract between an individual, the policyholder, and an insurance company. In exchange for regular premium payments, the insurance company agrees to provide a lump sum payment known as a death benefit to the policyholder's beneficiaries upon the policyholder's death. This financial payout is designed to provide financial support to the beneficiaries in the event of the policyholder's passing. There are several key components to understand about life insurance. Types of life insurance Term life insurance This type of policy provides coverage for a specific period, such as 10, 20 or 30 years. If the policyholder dies within the term, the death benefit is paid out to the beneficiaries. If the policyholder outlives the term, the coverage expires. Whole life insurance, also known as permanent life insurance, whole life insurance provides coverage for the entire lifetime of the policyholder. It also includes a cash value component that grows over time. Premiums for whole life insurance are usually higher than for term life insurance. Universal life insurance, similar to whole life insurance, universal life insurance is a type of permanent insurance with a cash value component. It offers more flexibility in premium payments and death benefits. Variable life insurance. This type of policy allows the policyholder to invest the cash value portion into various investment options, such as stocks and bonds. The cash value and death benefit can vary based on the performance of these investments. Premiums premiums are the regular payments the policyholder makes to the insurance company to maintain the life insurance coverage. The amount of the premium can depend on factors such as the policyholder's age, health, the type of policy, and the coverage amount. Death benefit. The death benefit is the amount of money the insurance company pays to the beneficiaries listed in the policy when the policyholder passes away. The beneficiaries can be family members, friends, or other individuals specified by the policyholder. Cash value, permanent life insurance policies, whole life, universal life, and variable life often include a cash value component. A portion of the premium payments goes into a cash value account that grows over time. This cash value can be borrowed against or withdrawn, but doing so can impact the policy's death benefit and overall performance. Underwriting, when applying for life insurance, the insurance company assesses the applicant's risk factors, such as age, health, lifestyle, and medical history. This process is known as underwriting and helps the insurer determine the appropriate premium and coverage. Beneficiaries Beneficiaries are the individuals or entities who will receive the death benefit when the policyholder passes away. It's important to keep beneficiary designations up to date to ensure the intended recipients receive the payout. Policy riders, these are optional add-ons to a life insurance policy that provide additional benefits or customization. Examples include accelerated death benefits, allowing the policyholder to access a portion of the death benefit if diagnosed with a terminal illness and waiver of premium waiving premium payment. If the policyholder becomes disabled, Life insurance serves several purposes, including providing financial protection for loved ones, covering funeral expenses, paying off debts, and leaving a legacy. The choice between term and permanent life insurance depends on your financial goals, budget, and needs. It's important to carefully consider your options and consult with a financial advisor or insurance professional to determine the best type and amount of coverage for your situation. Choosing the right life insurance policy involves considering various factors that align with your financial goals, 
family needs and overall circumstances. Here are some key factors to keep in mind when making your decision. Purpose of coverage. Determine the primary reason you're getting life insurance. Is it to provide financial security for your family, cover outstanding debts like a mortgage, fund your children's education, or leave behind an inheritance? Type of life insurance. Decide between term life insurance and permanent life insurance. Whole life, universal life, variable life. Consider your coverage needs, budget, and how long you need the coverage to last. Coverage amount, death benefit. Calculate how much money your beneficiaries would need if you were to pass away. Consider factors like outstanding debts, funeral costs, ongoing living expenses, and long-term financial goals. Premium costs. Understand how much you can comfortably afford to pay in premiums. Term life insurance generally has lower initial premiums compared to permanent life insurance, but they can increase over time. Policy term or duration. If you're considering term life insurance, choose a term that aligns with your coverage needs. For example, if you have young children, you might want a policy that lasts until they finish college. Financial stability. Research the financial stability and reputation of the insurance company you're considering. Ratings from independent agencies like A. M best and standard and pause can help gauge the insurer's financial strength. Riders and additional benefits. Check for optional riders that can enhance your policy, such as accelerated death benefits, waiver of premium or a return of premium rider for term policies. Cash value component for permanent policies. If considering a permanent policy with a cash value component, Understand how the cash value grows over time and how it can be accessed if needed. Underwriting process. Be prepared for a health assessment during the application process. Your health and lifestyle can impact your premium rates and eligibility. Beneficiary designations. Ensure you've designated beneficiaries clearly and kept the designations up to date especially after significant life events like marriage, divorce or the birth of a child. Tax implications Life insurance death benefits are typically not subject to income tax. However, it's wise to understand the potential tax implications of any cash withdrawals or policy surrenders. Future flexibility Consider whether the policy allows for adjustments in coverage or premium payments as your circumstances change. Consultation with professionals. It's advisable to consult with a financial advisor or insurance professional who can assess your specific needs and help you make an informed decision. Comparison shopping. Obtain quotes and policy details from multiple insurance companies to compare coverage options, costs, and features. Remember that life insurance is a long-term commitment, so taking the time to carefully evaluate your options and align them with your financial goals is crucial. Your decision should reflect your unique situation and provide peace of mind for you and your loved ones. Applying for life insurance. Applying for life insurance involves several steps to ensure you get the coverage that suits your needs and circumstances. Here's a general overview of the application process. Determine your needs. Assess your financial goals, family's needs, and the purpose of the life insurance coverage. Decide on the type of coverage, term or permanent, and the coverage amount death benefit that align with your objectives. Research and choose an insurer. Research reputable insurance companies that offer the type of coverage you're looking for. Consider their financial stability, customer reviews, and available policy options. Gather information. Collect the necessary personal, financial, and medical information required for the application. This might include your age, gender, health history, lifestyle habits, and any pre-existing medical conditions. 
Get quotes. Request quotes from multiple insurers based on your chosen coverage type, amount, and other relevant details. This will help you compare costs and policy features. Consult with an advisor. If you're unsure about the best policy for your needs, consider consulting a financial advisor or insurance agent. They can provide personalised recommendations and clarify any questions you have. Complete the application. Fill out the application form provided by the insurance company. Provide accurate and thorough information about your personal and medical history. Undergo medical examination. Depending on the coverage amount and type, the insurance company might require a medical examination. This can include a physical, blood tests, and possibly a urine sample. The insurer will arrange and cover the costs of these tests. Review and verification. Review the application form carefully before submitting it. Ensure that all the information is accurate and complete. The insurance company may verify the information through medical records and other sources. Underwriting process. The insurance company's underwriters will assess your application, medical exam results and other relevant factors. They will determine your risk level and eligibility for coverage. Policy offer and premium calculation. Based on the underwriting results, the insurance company will provide a policy offer. This offer will include the coverage details, premium amount and any policy riders or additional benefits. Acceptance and premium payment. If you're satisfied with the policy offer, you'll need to accept it and make the initial premium payment. This typically marks the start of your coverage. Policy issuance. Once the premium is paid, the insurance company will issue your policy. Read through the policy documents carefully to ensure they match your expectations and the terms you agreed upon. Beneficiary designation. Specify your chosen beneficiaries for the policy's death benefit. Ensure this information is accurate and up to date, as it will determine who receives the payout in the event of your passing. Coverage commencement. Your coverage begins once the policy is issued and the first premium payment is received. Remember that the application process can vary slightly depending on the insurance company and the type of policy you're applying for. It's essential to be honest and accurate when providing information during the application as any discrepancies could impact your coverage or claims processing in the future. If you have any questions or concerns, don't hesitate to reach out to the insurance company or your agent for clarification. In conclusion, life insurance is a vital financial tool that provides peace of mind and financial security for your loved one. By understanding the types of policies available and considering your specific needs, you can make an informed decision that aligns with your goals. Thank you for joining us today on the Septec Gates LLC YouTube channel. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up share it with others, and subscribe for more informative content. If you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in future videos, please let us know in the comments below. Until next time, take care and stay financially savvy.